Hey everybody, my name is Troy D and we're back. This is uh, my channel, Troy D 24 7 Mall. And today I wanted to do like a different format, uh, kind of like a, uh, I guess an, an ode to one of my favorite YouTubers, uh, Sultanazio, who I don't know if he still makes videos, but when I saw his videos, this is basically his format and I quite enjoyed it primarily too because, you know, you could just like zoom in on the bottle like this and uh, just marvel at how nice it is and how much you want it if you don't have it. But today we're going to talk about one of my favorite fragrances that I really have to share to you guys. If you guys had any uh, pre-assumptions about it or you just don't like the message of the company, uh, I will have to say that maybe this review will definitely change your mind. And uh, this uh, perfume we're going to talk about today is X by Clive Christian. The Clive Christian X. Now this is really interesting how I got the uh, the fragrance um, because this came from a guy that basically lives the high life. So really, it's really congruent to you know the perfume. You know, this is a guy that you know owns Ferraris, McLarens. He uses a Vertu phone. <laughs> if you don't know what a Vertu phone is, you can Google it, but. A Vertu phone is basically a really expensive phone that I think, I don't want to judge it, but I don't think it does the same things that, late, let's say, an Apple iPhone does. But it's extremely expensive, extremely luxurious. Some of them are covered in diamonds. And, uh, you know, this guy, he had a lot of these. He had boxes of these. Like, this is this is his signature set. He had boxes of these, these uh, OG 30 mil uh, sets. And uh, I guess he was just offloading them. And uh, when he found out that I was really, really interested in procuring them, well, he basically sold them for a deal. So I got all the three fragrances that they have for basically, I don't know, just <laughs> an amazing price. Let's just put it at that. Now, you know, think about that guy, right? I mean, this is the guy that... You know, he's got the Ferrari, you know. He probably does like a, a power lunch every now and then and goes to the boardroom. Maybe, you know, drives around the, uh, some of the most expensive beach properties in SoCal. And, uh, you know, maybe has dinner with uh, friends or maybe, uh, maybe some business mates. Probably goes to the golf course. And the fact that this is his signature scent, right? This is the one that he likes most tell something about not only the message but the scent that uh, Clive Christian X gives out all right it's very congruent now I don't own a Ferrari I know a lot of you guys don't own a Ferrari or a nice beachfront property maybe in uh, Santa Monica um, but this scent right here for perfume collectors especially for perfume collectors that always go for you know like a base collection like Aventus uh, because of the uh, fresh pineapple uh, scent that it gives very addictive scent or you know the type of guys who go for uh, Leighton because of the, uh, the the sheer sexiness or uh, Enigma because of the boozy uh, I would like you guys to consider this in your collection okay now what I'm, I'm wearing this right now by the way okay and what do I feel I feel really really manly in charge you know I feel like I'm about to do some power moves today I'm, a, I'm about to do some important moves today and the fact that it opens up with you know a little bit of citrus bergamot little bit of pineapple even then it turns to you know that sweet amber turns into the amber scent and then gets dominated by the woods you know this is probably one of the best woods woodsy perfumes you'll ever own the fact that they're all together 
means that this is a fragrance that is very, very versatile. And I would say that this fragrance has a benefit more for the wearer rather than like trying to get compliments. This is not that, okay? This is not this is not your compliment getter, okay? In my opinion, okay? This might make people around you feel that you smell good. Maybe that you smell good, maybe you smell amazing, smell different, smell really manly, masculine, in charge. But this isn't a compliment getter. I don't think this is like, you know, the Aventus or or the the Latins or the Enigmas uh, Elysiums, you know. But again, this is a benefit for the wearer. I feel like when you're wearing this, and this thing lasts all day long, strength is great. When you're wearing this, you really feel like you are in charge. It's almost like being the alpha male without being overly alpha, without even like really showing it, like, like trying to be, you know, alpha. It's just, you're the alpha and this is what you would wear. I guess that's why they got the crown up there, okay? It smells totally different from other creations. And I don't suggest that you just try it on a tester and judge it. You gotta wear it. You gotta wear it and you gotta remember the guy that sold this to me, who was wearing, you know, who, who had the Ferraris and is having this amazing high life. Now, where would I wear this? Again, because I'm the beneficiary of this, because I, this thing puts me in the mood, then that's exactly what I'm going to wear it for. You know, if I want to dominate the boardroom, I want to, I want to dominate the office. If I want to be the alpha of my group, if I'm trying to meet people and I want to make an impression, this is it right here. Okay. This is a very masculine scent. I mean, this is kind of huge, but for me, like this is something like James Bond would wear. If you know, James Bond doesn't date chicks and he doesn't fish for compliments. Chicks dig him because he's masculine AF. And that's the point of this, okay? When you're wearing this, it just, it makes you feel all of that. And it, it, it makes people gravitate towards you because that's the message that you're kind of sending out, that you're this masculine guy in charge. Um, it's, it's, it's powdery, peppery, elegant. But again, it's just, it puts you in a great mood. If you are the wearer of this, it, it just puts you in a great mood. Now I'm gonna say this, okay? The, the marketing of this is like the most expensive perfumes. Like, you know, that kind of marketing doesn't exist in today's internet world, okay? The fact that me, a guy in Los Angeles, was able to link up with the guy with the Ferraris and the Virtus to sell me this at a great price means that, you know, in the internet world, there's no such thing as expensive. Okay, I mean, you can afford it if you find it and it's, it's, it's finders keepers. And that's what I love about collecting. You know? um, there are so many connects online that could hook you up on this. And I implore you to watch the beginners video that I had on the channel because there's gonna be a lot of you know tips right there that you can use automatically and you can get maybe one of these at like a, a really, really great price, but there's no such thing. And so in terms of like, you know, purchases, I, I've seen people with massive collections, just a whole stash of perfumes, even uh, guys who, you know, try to save money by buying clones. I'm, I'm talking about clone, not colognes, clones like clone houses. I've seen them with enough clones that they, they have enough money to buy this, maybe 10 of these. Okay, so it's not about can you afford it or not. With uh, the guide that I gave you guys, the beginner guide, as well as all the means on the internet, online and offline, all the discounters and all the all the discounts that the retailers are giving away this Christmas season, you know, you can get this. Okay, you can get this. So I would say that if you are building a base collection right a base collection of just five fragrances that you want to start with in the niche world definitely you gotta add this i have to say 
A lot of people will have the woodsy, the aromatic, the boozy, like I said. But this one is strictly linear, manly, making moves, making smart decisions, showing some luxury. Some luxury. You don't need a Ferrari to wear this. But to the wearer, I, f I believe that the benefits are to the wearer. The person that wears this feels the alpha. You know? That's what it does. It is, it is fresh to where you can wear it the entire day. It's got the ambery goodness and then the woodsy. The woodsy that just that makes it so luxury. The, 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 the cedar wood um, and the oak moss, you know, it just, just, it just makes this very luxurious. And it is something that you can wear day or night and it, I, I have it on. It, it, it lasts all day long. And it's, again, supremely different very worth it to add to anybody's collection you know you don't have to follow the buying trends of people that have to buy this 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 you know just try it sample it on your skin and try to cop one of these because this is amazing so guys thank you for watching this really quick video that i make made on my my, my perfume shelf I, I i just didn't have time today to uh make a full video like i always do but until then, guys, please subscribe. I thank you for your support. And uh, till then, goodbye.